number 38 bus going home. Just want to do a quick update about Anthony Davis. You know, the gentleman who's the same age as me that is trapped in jail on a 35 year sentence for murder. A murder which all the top barristers in this country say is one of the most unsafe convictions ever. Anyway, I was destined, destined? Due and destined, I guess. I was destined to go and see Anthony my first ever prison visit. I mean, I've been to, you know, police station prisons and shit like that, courthouse prisons, but I've never been to a, a proper prison. And um, I was due to go and visit him on the 19th of June, about two weeks ago. And the day before, the actual prison itself, I'll get you the name of the prison, and if I remember, I'll put it in the description box. There, there's a lady who works there called Rachel Campbell, and she is the offender manager. And I guess her job is to check out, make sure visitors are not gangsters or terrorists going to come and blow up the prison. Anyway, this Rachel Campbell woman, she denies my visit to go see Anthony Davis in jail. And uh, what she did was, she looked me up on the police records, and the, the Metropolitan Police has me down as a troublesome anarchist. And this is what she told um, Anthony's lawyer in the, um, on the phone. And so that got cancelled and now the lawyer sent me all this documentation that the BBC had to do a high court judicial review to go and see some prisoners. So I just want to keep you guys updated. The film's still being made, it's just that to try and go and see a man um, held for life for murder is very difficult, especially when you have the kind of uh, notoriety with the police that I do. But the film will be made.